y'all have okay. been fighting to be recognized by the, the Emmys. You know, one of the biggest problems we've seen for a very long time is that our shows, black shows, uh, shows centered with black leads and all that are largely neglected by the Emmys. Um, you know, you can look at the popularity of shows like Power. You know, you can look at the popularity of shows like Empire. Um, they can be popular, but our the leads of these shows or even the supporting cast, they don't get recognized. And the shows themselves don't get recognized. And I know you guys have put out a really big push, um, you know, for, for your consideration. You guys have done that and all of that. What's your take on the Emmys how important is it to you um, to receive an award like that? Um, and do you feel like there might be some real change um, happening in the industry around, um, you know, recognizing our art? You know, I hope so, Bevy. The, the fact of the matter is there's a lot of change that needs to happen. Um, and and there, there is, as you have so astutely pointed out, there is a lack of equity in these spaces, you know, in, in reference to how our shows are uh, celebrated. Uh, black shows are celebrated um, by the sort of um, academies, whether that be in film or, or in television. Uh, we even see it in the theater world, too. Uh, black actors, even in reference mm-hmm. to pay, the pay, the pay disparity. Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, we also often see that Black and brown folks, uh, minorities, uh, or so-called minorities, are often paid less than their white counterparts. And so, you know, how... I don't know what the answer is <laughs> to, to solve that, aside from getting new people in these positions of power who recognize the beauty, the value, and the worth of black people and black work. Um, and, and so, you know, th- in addition to, um, creating my own work and putting myself in a position to, um, to, to, to hire other black and brown folks and other queer folks, uh, in addition to, um, fighting for social justice and equality by protesting in these streets, by getting out and voting, by going to my council meetings and getting involved civically in addition to speak, using my platform to speak out. I'm also speaking out um, to the agencies and the management companies that represent mm-hmm. me and the PR firms and all of these folks who are sort of the gatekeepers of our industry and saying to them, okay, let's put our money where our mouth is. We talk mm-hmm. about how, you know, Black Lives Matter. Everybody wants to say Black Lives Matter now. What does that really mean?